In this review, we're going to be going over the new features available to you in the account dashboard. Let's start at the top by taking a look at the time selector. Here you can select whether you want to look at the last month, week, or select a custom time period if you wish. All the data in the charts will be shown for the period you select compared to the period before that. So in this case, we're looking at the past month. That means that we'll look at the data for this month as compared to the month before that. At the very top of the page here, we see what we call the KPI banner. Here, your key performance indicators will be listed as they compare to the month before. In these examples here, you can see that our value is up by 16% while our interactions are down by 51%. Once we've looked at the KPI banner, we're going to want to go down and dig into some more details. So let's say we want to look and see why our interactions are down by so much. We'll scroll down, and we can see here that interactions are down because there was a large spike in the previous month. As you can see in this case, or as we show across all these graphs, the colored graph actually indicates what happened this month, whereas the gray graph shows what happened the month before. Similarly, we can look at something like conversion value here, and we get to see how this plays out this month as compared to the month before. We also have some supporting data shown here, so we can dig in to understand why we're seeing the data we're seeing. In this case, we can see that the total value that we've garnered in this month is up by 16%, while the number of conversions is down, which means that we have a much higher conversion to value ratio. That's fantastic. If we wanted to dig in a little bit more to see even more about this, to see why we're seeing such changes, we can go in to view the supporting data. Each one of these graphs has a similar supporting data. By clicking on that, we'll be brought to an area that replicates some of the information we saw on the main dashboard, but is supported by outlier information. When we show outliers, what we're actually showing is the items that have changed the greatest in the time period selected. In this case, we're looking at goals, and you can see that this free trial sign-up goal has increased by, over, by $780. You will see increases and decreases mixed throughout this because we're looking at total absolute change, so things that swing the most, because those are the things that have the greatest impact on your numbers. You can reach these drill-down pages by clicking on any of the items in the KPI banner. We hope you find this useful, and please be sure to take a look at the white paper that we've also released that goes into great detail about how you can perform a fantastic social media review with the information provided on these pages. Thanks a lot. Take care.